Welcome back guys to Mass Effect Andromeda as we invade the Ket's base with enemies all around also trying to find information hidden away and security consoles and the whatnot that we have to find ourselves overrides all around the place. So we're missing one more override for the main shield supposedly. And supposedly the destination markers are marked on the map as well. Not that I've seen them as we wonder where this enemy is to be honest. Alright well before we go out there again it's definitely, yes, health bits around. We can definitely hear the enemies trying to get closer to us, can't we? Oh, joy of joys. Right, where are you then? You're below me. But there's also something here. I think I missed. That's it. One Krogan charge will do the job. Seem to enjoy that. This is the cat defense matrix. Destroying it will disable all sentry turrets and unlock access to the secure storage structure. That sounds nice. This is a critical subsystem. Sabotaging three of these will disable the defense matrix. Then let's get to that, eh? So you can see where it leads. Question is, does that get me anything? I sabotage this one. And I wonder, ah, oh, that's the other one that sabotages it. Defense matrix has been destroyed. The secure storage structure is now unlocked. All right, let's see what the cat we're hoarding. All right, many markers on the map again. With that removing what's up over here? No, that's still shielded, annoyingly. All right, optional access to the secure storage. The question is, it gives us like these locations, but it doesn't put us on the right marker for it all. So we've got that over there and the data from the console. We need to get over to that before we do anything. So let's take a right at the end here. Well, look of it. As long as we put our own waypoints down, we should be fine. Oh, I probably don't want to tell them I'm here. Oh, I don't know if they're here themselves. Definitely something to scan nearby, though. So it tells me by the rumble. Like I said, I can't see anything definitive to scan. Well, it vibrates, but we've opened this now. Unless you're telling me something in here. There's more in the room above. Alright, let's take their goods. Then my item limit is pretty much nearly filled. In fact, it's going to be filled, I bet. Very, very shortly. That's what I need to get rid of is some armor. Let's hack this. Alright, Sam has located logs associated with the start of the cat invasion. Specialists identified an isolated station on a minimal rich lunar world as initial target. Routine attack, element of surprise, no major threats. Majority were easily eliminated, providing genetic material for study. Live specimens were also acquired as a result of an unexpected surrender. Next entry. Captured on Gar proved useful. Cooperation secured in exchange for keeping them alive. Obtain live blood samples with no resistance. Volunteer demonstration of bioenergetic field. Applications identified them as prime candidates. Mention of the center of the civilization Aya. Location hidden in the Scourge. No maps exist. Route learned through experience. Interrogation ongoing. Once complete, recommend transfer to home empire as vassals. Logs on Angara first contact isolated Pathfinder. Wow. Sounds like some of the first Angara the Ket found were coerced into working with them. We should show this to Ari Bezcek. That's very interesting. Right. Let's keep on checking though. 
That guy's somewhere around us now. Where is he? Alright, so we checked out everything there. We've just got to get to our last power generator. Which is over that way, by the look of it. Way off that way. Essentially, we've got free run of the base if you don't count. Ah, found him! I can't hit you from here. It looks like he's stuck. He fell through the ground. Done. Well, now we're finally free from enemy around us for the time being. You can bet there'll be more. Right. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Thank you, Sam. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Thank you, Sam. Life support restored. Thank you, Sam. All generators have been disabled. I have marked the coordinates of the security terminal. Destroy it to unlock access to the Ket Tower. I think I know where that is then. Oh. 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 I have that jump between a fair bit of them. I know I probably need that for someone else. Oh, you ran past him? Why? And some above as well. Well, I'm going to skip back into here and fight from this bit. We're probably going to get overrun shortly. What about dealing with the ones right at your feet? Oh, that's the Krogan. Yeah, that's, that's our guy. Okay, I'll freeze. You do the rest. Nope. Um, back off. No scope. Missed. Now our Krogan saw them out. Go on, Drac. I'm detecting below normal temperatures. Yeah, well, we survived again. That's all I care about. The ambient temperature is normal. Yeah, yeah, I know. Something else flying in? I thought I heard something. Well, there's a ton of ammo down here. So don't mind if I do. Of course you want me up there now. Alright. Say destroy it? What if we read it first? Oh, obviously not. To the tower. To the tower. Could have garnered some nice information, but still to the tower. The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Right, now where's the best way round to the tower? Around there? Thankfully we destroyed all the guns. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Oh hello! Oh. So open that grenade would do the job. I blind jumped over to there, thinking that's definitely a place I can stay. Well, that's my item limit. Now, if I want more guns, what do I do? Well, first of all, activate this. Life support is stable. So we've got to reach the hangar bay. Is that from down below? Or onwards. There's multiple ways to reach here, was there? Whoa! What? Oh, too bad for them. They spawned upon a Krogan. You're not going to live that very well. You spawned upon me as well. That scared me a little bit, but... We get through. We get by. That was the stuff that's supposed to spawn if you're going down the other way. So I can't take that for a moment. Assault rifle accuracy minus 10% stability. So how do I go about junking stuff I do not want? That is now the question, isn't it? 
Right, for example, we got legs. We got several different types of legs at this point. Yeah, I don't really need the initiative stuff, do I? Yeah, it's a good idea. Doesn't really give me anything compared to, for example, like that. And we get gear. F we get stuff for it. Yeah, nicely done. Maybe I should have gone with the extra experience with that as well. I don't know. Might actually give us a little bit more space, if I'm right in saying. So junking gear goes like that. I probably need to go and sort a lot of that out in time. Where are these guys going? Don't mind if I do, I'll take a free shot. I can hit you there, can't I? Definitely prefer to go for the headshot though. Oh, he, he staggered a bit. Wasn't so much incoming cat as it was outgoing cat, wasn't it, really? They ran away to start with. And got there. shot a ton. Let's hope that stops them. What's this round table about? Like I said, there's definitely enemies that way. I just gotta say, when a sniper is shooting you, it's usually not a good idea to take the spot that was last sniped at. Your overall survival, it is not good. There we go, let's get a little bit more patience. And get another skill up. Kept fusion armor free, I'll take that. At some point, I'm just going to want to drop the experience stuff and go for damage stats. Right. That said, we did just level up as well, which means we do have a ton more skills that we can apply. In fact, we've leveled up twice, so I can now, if I want to, upgrade my sniper rifles to the next level. Which is rank 6, damage and force. 20% sniper rifle damage and 20% sniper rifle force. Or I could go with on kill rate of fire boost plus 30% on kill stability boost 40% on kill reload speed boost 25%. Do you know what? I'm quite fine with just doing more damage. Yeah, I'm quite fine with doing more damage to be fair. That works for me. And I can also get that extra weapon slot if I want or I can upgrade... Weapon damage and go towards combat detonator damage bonus. And stuff for melee bonus per hit, stuff like that. Let's take that for now. And that unlocks soldier rank 2. Our sniper rifle is now at maximum. We have four points which we could stick in overload or incinerate. Now... Do I want extra recharge speed so I can throw out more or extra damage so, of course, I just take the shield down more? Hmm. Well, you can get 50% damage versus shields there as well, which is what I'm really interested in. Let's go with damage and then go with damage versus shields. No, actually, let's go... No. Yeah, no, let's go recharge speed so I can check it out more and then go with damage versus shield. That's what I'm going to go with. I don't know if it's the best choice, optimal or not, but I just want to throw out more, basically. Be all and end all, that's what I'm after. So five points for you, should we keep leveling up Avenger Strike? It's not a bad idea. It means you're quite rounded out. Same for Drac. God, the other guys are going to have tons of stuff to upgrade, aren't they? Yeah, it works for me. I've got the tanky characters with me after all. I know I can just press circle to get over the mantle. But I'm a rebel. And now I should do a one shot headshot if I'm right in saying. That should be nice. A 
looks like we're almost here, but it would look to me like we're going to have to fight something to get in. I don't know about you. I don't know about you. Pathfinder, it appears each of the hangar platforms has an automated fueling system. If you can access the controls, I can overload the system. Where's the other guy then? So there's two marks on the map over here. Now one's lower down. Could be sneaky, could be stealthy. Let's just finish that one fast. Put a ton of powers and stuff into it, and so the fight begins. I saw you out. It's especially useful to have it faster because, of course, it can paralyze enemies, can't it? Which works in my favor a little bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you're doing? I think everyone just chucked powers in. That was a better headshot than normal. Right, so. Let's keep clearing the way for the time being. It's definitely more. Can't see them though, however. Let's press this first console and get that done. Or do we just straight destroy it? Sabotage. Damn, the controls are locked. Pathfinder, I have located several override terminals in what? the vicinity. I was gonna say, there's definitely some invisible blokes as well. Oh, come on, get up. Headshot. Though then he went invisible. Oh, headshot. Go for that. Whatever that is, it's not gonna hit me. Ah, oh, there you are. Low ammo. I've got a shield. Which means I can always take all the time I want before I can shoot you again. Something shoot me from behind. What I need though is ammo, isn't it? I can always stealth if I get myself in a bad location right now. I'm relying on anyway. You made me have to push forward then, guy, which kind of sorted your own death, really. I guess I should get some more points in combat rifles shortly. A rifle for combat, obviously. Right. Oh, you're over there. Trying to go for accuracy there. That's what I'm after, though, really. Right. So there's one over here as well, is there? Actually, you just override one and then you've got to do the rest. It's a bit roundabout eat, and I guess the enemies just keep on coming. Get ready to fight! Oh, that's one done. Yeah, you've got to activate one and then activate another. By the look of things, ah. 
Poor guy. I definitely like this freezy corner though. It definitely allows me time. Definitely hit him, didn't I? How we take his shields down? Then I can do this. Nope, oh, he got flam. Alright, where's this one? I'm gonna burn? Okay. There's gonna be a ton of remains here once we're done. That's for sure. Alright, so one's underneath us. We got another enemy around here. Aha! That'll take you out of stealth, won't it? Take that. Messing with me. Right. Tons more enemies to get. Tons more consoles to activate. And I bet a boss at the end of it. So for now, as the enemies keep on coming, we'll end it for this episode as we sabotage another of the flight points. And move on from there. Ah! <laughs> Next time. Bye-bye.